Transport Minister Wesley Nukund announced that the department is currently looking into improving public transport services. With so many issues affecting PMV owners and public transport users, plans are afoot to put an end to the troubles. We have a plan. We have a transport, uh, national transport uh, strategy. We have a plan. And it's part of the plan that we are trying to sort of modernize the public transport system in the country. So uh, uh, the, the public must understand that the transport department has a plan for public transport in the country. He says for years, taxis and bus drivers have caused inconvenience to students and workers using public transport. So the, right now you see that the taxis, they are blue and green and all kinds of taxis around. And we need to change. And we can't continue to do that. And then the buses, you see, there are so many buses, but most of them, you see, have some defects. But we need to, we need to, uh, you know, it's about time we change so that, uh, you know, we are a developing country. The, the face of the city has changed completely over the last five years. And you see all the roads and everything. And the face of the city has changed. So we have to change the public transport system in the country as well, starting with taxis, buses, with PNG hosting the APEC 2018 summit, Minister Nukun says there is no better time to fix our public transport services to match first world countries. Our transport system must be the same as others. So we have to, our transport system must be equal to Indonesia, Malaysia, Singapore and Australia. So if they can do that, why not we? It's just that we have not started. We have been talking a lot. We, waited for the, we wait for the buses to go on strike or we wait for the taxis to go on strike. Or we wait for something to happen and then we start jumping up and down. When the situation cools down, we just let everything go. Nukun says other issues taken into account in the plan are traffic rules, car registration, dealership, licensing and road user fees. The minister said one long-term goal of the transport department is to implement electronic service systems. Expressions of interest will be advertised for interested companies willing to run the country's public transport services. Godwin Eki, National MTV News.